This video has been all over the place. Hey guys, it's McKenna. I'm vlogging again. I never know how to start vlogs. I feel weird. Like, do I explain to you what I'm doing? I don't know. This is my last week of school, so I thought I'd vlog. Not that really anything exciting is happening. Most of my classes that I'm taking this semester, like, don't have, like, a final exam. It's more like a final project that I have, like, a week or two to work on. So, like, maybe that's kind of fun. Talk to you about, like, the projects that I'm working on. I might do some fun stuff this weekend who knows it's monday and i have classes on mondays and wednesdays and i only have two of my classes today i have my business class this morning which we're just doing like we did a book report and we have to like we did like a written book report and then we have to do like an oral report on the book i already did mine i did mine last week but we're just like sitting and watching other people report on business books very exciting and then i have my musical theater class so i have those two classes in person today and then i still have two classes online my business class is my first class of the day and my musical theater class is my last class of the day so i have like a three hour break in the middle of the day that i'm going to work on my online classes so yeah that's what today looks like it's kind of a boring day but it's a weekly vlog you got to start on monday okay so my class actually finished early i was only in there for like 15 minutes so i'm going to do homework now but i kind of feel like that was a waste of going like i didn't really even need to go to that but i'm here so i'm gonna go get some work done <laughs> Happy Tuesday. I worked earlier today, but that was boring, so we didn't talk about that. Um, and now I'm working on homework. I am so ready for the semester to be done. It just needs to be done. But I realized that I haven't like explained to you what finals I have and like what I'm doing for like final projects and stuff like that. Is that interesting? I don't know, but I'm gonna tell you anyways. This is my third semester of college. I am taking five classes this semester, three in person and two online. For the three classes that I I'm taking in person. I took intro to business, which I finished that class. I finished it yesterday. For that final, we just had to do like a book report and I did mine on a book called Artpreneur because it had to be like a business book, obviously, which that book was really interesting if you're an artist and wanting to like sell your art and make a living off of it. And then I took intro to sociology, which that class has been finished for a few weeks, actually. <laughs> for that final, I had to write another essay, but it was technically like a service learning class, which means that like volunteering and like doing service service hours as part of the curriculum like you have to do it so our class decided to do a campaign at school for denim day which is like a sexual assault awareness campaign and then we had to write an essay connecting like our experience doing the volunteering to like a theory that we learned about in sociology and then my other in-person class is musical theater history we do have like an exam for that which is tomorrow so once I take that exam then I'll be finished with my in-person classes and don't have to go back to school my two online classes, I took a literature class. I don't remember what it's called. Literature and Contemporary Cultures. And our final project for this class is another essay. But I don't mind essays. I would rather write an essay than take an exam. This essay, we had to do like a comparison between two books we read. Because we read four books this semester, so we had to pick two and like compare like themes and literary elements and stuff um so that's actually what i'm working on right now you can't see but and then my other class is a video editing class we have like weekly assignments so i still have to do that this week and then on top of that we have a final project that's like a short film which sounds extreme but it only has to be like a minute or two long so it's not really like that big of a deal and it's like fictional can be about whatever we want and then that's it i'm done oh also i don't know if i mentioned this but but I'm in community college right now and I graduate at the end of the year like in December So I'll have my associates in December and then I'm planning on transferring to university to get my bachelor's Which is so weird that I only have one semester left at the school. Anyways, I'm gonna work on my essay Okay, I'm back. It's been a little bit. I'm in the same spot So it doesn't look like I've moved but it's been like an hour. I'm working on my film class video class stuff it's loading right now but yeah that's literally all that's happening that's probably it for right now i don't know if i'm gonna do anything later but that's what's happening right now excuse my appearance 
or don't i look fabulous right now i am now filming for my final project for my um film class well it's not really a film class it's more of like a this bowl is too big hang on okay anyways i got a smaller bowl it's really just like video editing it has like nothing to do with film but i'm majoring in film so it kind of does have to do with that a little bit we were pretty much given like full creative freedom to like do whatever we wanted and just like make a fictional short film about whatever we wanted so i'm currently in the process of making fake blood right now as for some reason whenever like in any of the film or video classes i've ever taken whenever i'm given like full creative freedom to do whatever i want my mind automatically goes to horror it's just like the first thing that comes to mind so that's what i'm doing if you don't know how to make fake blood there are lots of ways that you can make fake blood this is the recipe that i use it's corn syrup red food coloring and chocolate syrup and it's also edible but i don't recommend putting this on your body because it's really sticky and disgusting and it might stain you because it's food coloring but i'm really only making this because i don't have real fake blood and i'm really just patiently waiting for it to get a little bit darker because actually maybe it's dark enough because i need to film this when it's dark outside but i don't want it to be like pitch black because then I'll have to use artificial light and then it'll look weird. Anyways, I got my fake blood and I'm gonna go be a filmmaker, whatever. Okay, I was literally just about to come on here and talk about my hair. In person, my hair doesn't look as bad as it looks on camera. I, I looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, I don't look half bad right now. And then I look on my camera and I'm like, Okay, anyways, it's Wednesday, and today is my last day in person. Today is technically supposed to be the last day of school completely, like, for everyone, but for some reason, my online classes go to Friday. I have my last exam today, or my only exam today. I still have to do some, like, finishing touches on my video class project thing that I've been working on. I was getting ready, and I decided to put my hair in a ponytail today because I have not worn my hair in a ponytail in literally years like i used to only wear my hair in ponytails and now i hate wearing my hair in ponytails so i put my hair in a ponytail because it's kind of hot outside and i was like i haven't worn my hair in a ponytail in a while like let's try it and it didn't look half bad like i'm still looking at myself in the mirror and i don't think it looks terrible but then i look on here maybe it's the angle it's messy and like that's what i wanted but like maybe it is the angle i don't like the ponytail anymore we're taking the ponytail out i do only have one class and it's my last class of the day so i don't have to be at school until like one and then i don't know if i'm doing anything after school i'll probably like go get coffee oh my god i just i just makeup brushed my eyeball um anyways i'm kind of a mess today um i'll probably go get coffee we'll, like celebrate being finished even though i get coffee every wednesday we'll just pretend it's a celebration <laughs> yeah i think that's it for today i just really want to go get this exam done also do y'all like my shirt it came in the mail a few days ago. I just ordered it. Anyways, I'm gonna go to school and take this exam and be done. Okay, I finished my exam and it was okay. I don't think I got 100% on it, but I didn't fail it, so that's good. And then we got coffee and now we're going to the grocery store. No, 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 so no. exciting. Well, we're at Sam's. That's way different. So fun. Okay, I just got home from dinner. My camera won't focus. Hello. The whole family went out to dinner for my Aunt Samantha's birthday, um, and we got sushi, and I didn't vlog any of it. I'm gonna just chill out for the rest of the night, so yeah, that's, that's it. Happy Thursday, everyone. I'm getting ready to add the final touches to my short film for my film class because it's the last thing I have to do. I just want to mark it off my list and be done with it. I'm about to go outside, actually, to record Foley, which I actually kind of like doing. Um, if you don't know what Foley is, it's basically like, like homemade sound effects. You record the sound effects along with the recording and like record them yourself because you can get like free sound effects obviously like online they have tons of free sound effects but sometimes it's hard to get them to line up like you can get free footstep recordings but they don't always line up with the footsteps that you recorded like they might be like walking at a different speed or whatever so it's hard to get them to line up so it ends up being easier to record them yourself and I think it's really hot outside, so I don't really want to go outside, but I need grassy footsteps, so. I'm too lazy to actually put the shoe on, so we're just going to pretend. Okay, that did not work. 
Okay, we're done outside. Thank God, it's hot. I'm putting the finishing touches on my video and I'm about to export it and then turn it in and then I'll be finished. I'm done. I don't know what I'm gonna do now. Just sit and stare at the wall maybe. That seems like a good idea. Um, I'm kidding, but also probably not kidding. I might do that. We'll see. I don't know. I'll update you later. Okay, it's been a little bit and I cannot believe I forgot about my last day of school, first day of summer tradition. I watched Dazed and Confused on the last day of school or the first day of summer, depending on what I'm doing. And I've done it every year since like freshman year of high school. It's on right now. I love this movie. It is my favorite movie of all time. My ultimate comfort movie. I've seen it a bajillion times. So that's what I'm watching. I think that's kind of it. I'm tired. I've had quite the week. Happy Friday, everyone. Um, I'm currently eating strawberries. Anywho, I've been doing a whole lot of nothing today. I have been tanning. I've been outside all morning because I've come to the conclusion that I am solar powered because when the sun's out, so am I. If the sun's not out, I'm not doing too hot normally. It's been super rainy and gross where I live for like the past two weeks. So I haven't been able to go out and sit in the sun in like forever. So that's what I'm doing today. And I came inside to take a break because it's really hot outside and I didn't want to like pass out. And then I'm probably going to go back outside again and hopefully not get attacked by bugs. I love fruit. I think fruit's my favorite food. I could live on fruit. I do. Okay. I'm going to go back outside. See you later. I am back inside for good now. I think it's too hot out there. I can't, I can't handle it. I'm eating watermelon now. I've switched fruits and I'm watching a movie. Who's surprised? I'm watching Night of the Living Dead, which surprisingly I've never seen before. About five minutes in, it's good so far. It's an old horror movie from the 60s if you've never heard of it. But I really think that's it for today. That's, this seems like a boring video, but I have some exciting stuff tomorrow going on. So I'll see you tomorrow. Happy Saturday, guys. I'm getting ready to go to work right now. So I work today and then guess where I'm going? To another concert. If you've been watching a lot of my vlogs this year, I've been going to a lot of concerts lately. They're just fun and I like going. The thing about this concert tonight is that it's in Colombia, which I was just in Colombia like two weeks ago, I think, for Nacho Fest, if you watched that. Vlog. we're going back it's actually at the same venue i'm going to see maya hawk which if you don't know who that is she's a very very talented musician super cool person most people probably know her because she was robin in stranger things she also makes music she also has very famous parents her parents are uma thurman and ethan hawk and she's actually opening for a band that's playing at rose music park in columbia she's opening for a band called bright eyes which i've heard of but i don't really listen to so i don't think we're gonna stay for their entire set um since it's kind of far away and we're like not spending the night or anything but i get off work at five and the doors for the concert open at 6 30 and i like to get there early so i like to get there like around the time the doors open it's about an hour and a half away from like where i live and where i work so my mom is gonna pick me up from work and we're gonna go there immediately so that we can get there at a decent time so yeah that is the deal today i'm gonna go to work we are in the car and i i'm out of work obviously and we're on our way to columbia i still need to change and stuff but i can do that later i'm a pro at changing in the car um but we're gonna try some new m m's are these new? So when we go to concerts and like go kind of far away, we like we pack a cooler and bring snacks and stuff. So these are caramel cold brew M and M's. They they were in the cooler, so they're probably like frozen. Hmm. Oh weird. It just tastes like it has caramel in it, and then it tastes like coffee. Those are yummy. That was pretty good. Okay, we made it. Um, it's really crowded. I was not expecting it to be this crazy. I don't know why, I just didn't think that it was gonna be that crowded. Very crazy. But it's 6.30, the doors just opened, and the line is like really long. We're here, we made it.
told you one true thing I let you believe I've been alone all spring Our voices quivered and we took a deep breath Like we got something heavy off of our chest Everything I should be yours too Including the pain of losing you Her birthday's two days before mine. Oh, is it? So well, it's I mean, because she, we're cancers. She took and went down the aisle for everybody waiting and let I think, them have whatever they wanted. I think I recorded that. She was like, we're just gonna go down the line and give you what you want. Yeah. I'm gonna go one side, I'm gonna go down, and I'm gonna give you whatever you want. Oh my it. God. Okay. So we're in the car, we're on our way home. <laughs> Columbia was nice for like two hours. Mm. My camera's about to die. I'll do a merch haul when I get home. Yeah, that was great. That was a great time. I'll talk to you when we get home. Okay, I'm back home. My hair, don't talk about my hair. I'll show you what merch I got. Um, I got a t-shirt. This is the front. And this is the back. I love t-shirts with things on the back. And then I also got um, her vinyl. And it's signed. She didn't sign it like in front of me, but it's signed. Oh, this says it's translucent orange. I kind of want to open it. It has a thingy in it. If you watched my thing about record store day, I talked about my love for records that have things in them, posters, books with the lyrics in them, just a sheet with the lyrics on it, whatever. I love this. So we ended up staying for like two of Bright Eyes' songs. I didn't want to get home like super late. It's it's 11 o'clock and we're just now getting home. So I didn't want to stay like all night. She was very nice. One of the nicest people I've ever met. There was like maybe like 10 or 15 people standing like on the street. And I think I recorded this, but she literally came out and gave everyone hugs. And then was like, I'm just gonna go down the line and like give everyone what they want. So like be thinking about what you want. Um, and was like signing stuff and taking pictures and was really nice and was like actually like stopping and talking to everyone. Anyways, that's the video. This video's been all over the place. It's it's been a it's been a week. It's been a weird week. But yeah, finals were fine. Whatever. <laughs> I met Maya Hawk. I don't know what's happening, but I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. I'll see you next Sunday. Love you. Bye.